party people in the place to be, live from 58 Dream Street, Greg and James, beat them up! That's right, it's a Twitch show where this guy, James, and this guy, Greg, play beat em up video games! You get the idea. Mm -hmm. We don't need to belabor the point. And we are, this week, uh, continuing what is probably going to be the last game for a long time that requires more than one uh, evening of our time to really mm -hmm. get the experience. We are playing mm -hmm. Shiorai Niketsu Kua Konyokan, uh, the original hot-blooded Niketsu tough guy. No, hot-blooded Niketsu, the same word. The original hot-blooded tough guy Kunio, uh, which is the first Super Famicom entry in the Kunio-kun series, uh, which is itself the, uh, you know, better known as River City Ransom, or the River City series in North America. Mm -hmm. We, uh, yeah, hold on a moment. I better lean around Where's here. Where's the issue? Ah. She had to find the correct ROM to load, right. which I believe I... Wait. So, yes? So when we left, we had completed the first section of the game, Yamada. Uh, gotten on the train to yes. go to the next section. Although we somehow ended up not... We, we ended up going back and then failing to get on the train a second time. Yep. And, now, and now we do have to get back to the train and just get on the train. We do, yes. Yeah. Uh, so that is... That's a lot of... That's a lot of the key details. Uh, yeah. The story so far is that Kunio is on a class trip to Osaka. Osaka, Japan. As it yeah. happens, so is Riki. They run into each other. They're like, what are you doing here? They're kind of both, you know, reticent. But they also choose to gravitate to each other because they're the alphas of their respective schools. Yeah. And then there's a, there's a gang in Osaka called the Osaka Student Union mm -hmm. that is uh, just bad and... So they keep beating up Kunio's nerd friend, which is a common motivator for him. And but the so nerd friend has a girl. It. Yep, there's who, a lady who is in town and is organizing a force against. The there's a resistance union. being organized, yeah. although as it so far turns out, we're doing most of the work, most of the legwork here. So that's basically the the idea. If you're invested in the Kunio Kun uh, chronology. I'll let you know that this game takes place after the original game, Niketsu Kua Kunio-kun. Which, by the way, the, as distinct from this game, which is called the original. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Uh, it's set after the original. <laughs> it's set after the original. But prior to uh, River City, the game we call mm, River City Ransom, or Downtown Niketsu Story. It is set in... I believe we have proper saves that we can use. I believe so, yeah. Oh, but then this comes up. Oh, is there one player file and two player file? Or is yours gone? Let's find it. No, no, no. I think I'm next. Do you do yours? Oh, because did you pick... No, I've, I've gone. Did you pick the same one? No. Wait, before? No, you named one last time? Well, you definitely don't want to start a new one. We have a save state just in case this yeah, yeah, happened. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we'll just return to the save state. Here we go. Yeah. So this is the uh, the later junior high years, as I understand, in these characters' uh, lives. I'm not in. Whereas downtown Niketsu story. Oh ho. Uh, that, that might be. I think that's just because I'm in the menu. Oh okay. Yeah. Here we go. Nope. Still no. not in. You're no, not no, in. no. 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 Yes, I'm in. Right. My okay. joysticks just weren't working. Ah. Huh. Well. Right. Now they are. Excellent. So yeah. Here we are. We have fought our way clear to a different neighborhood than the one we started in at the other end. And then we had missed that there were, we were supposed to return for a cutscene. Oh. oh wait, yeah, here we are. I heard what Mio was saying. I want to get revenge for Hiroshi too! Okay. Where is everyone gathering? Kunio. Come on, tell me! That's Shinsai Bashi. Thanks! Alright. Alright. Good. We'll have him there with us at least. So interestingly, something I actually only just noticed. 
No, and never mind. Now I take it back. We do have slightly different faces. Yep. I have thicker eyebrows than you. Yeah. For a moment I thought, wait, these guys are literally palette swaps, which has not been the case in the past. Kishimoto has started a fight. You gotta be careful about starting fights on the edge, since it's entirely possible for someone to get in there and uh, get a lot of hits on you mm -hmm. with a shockingly high level of damage. The real killer in this game is the invisible stats that determine damage. There are just, there's some enemies that we've met so far that have absurdly high defense, so it takes forever to defeat them in a fight. Yeah. Oh, and, and absurdly also, high attacks. So the they random the account range. rate in this game is also... A little high, a little high. I like the general idea that a fight can break out at any time in this zany universe, but that you, like... But you never know. But in execution, it does... <laughs> That was a very diffident kick yeah. for the knockout. Prepaid hey, cash card. Hey, we got a prepaid cash card. We haven't found anywhere we can spend our prepaid cash cards yet, but it's good to know that. Uh, up here. So it was up here. <laughs> so even though we took a week off, the route the is to... burned into our minds. I think if there was a little more, like, oh, precipitating the random fights, like, oh, damn it. Like, what if we, uh, what if you could just accidentally bump into people? Like, you had to be watching that you didn't bump into a random guy on the street and start a fight if you're trying not to. Or if the rate was lower, also. There are yeah. a lot of things you could do that aren't exactly what they did here. Moment to moment fighting, pretty good, but not better than uh, any of the previous games, including the original, Niketsu Kouakuryo <laughs> Uh, but also not better than the NES game, the Famicom games, uh, Downtown Niketsu Story and uh, Niketsu Downtown Special, Kunio's historical yep. period drama. Oh, no. See? No. No. No, Yamada. The move. There we go. Okay, hold on. Do I have... You've got a, a key power, but also Ooh. maybe we have a consumable food. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. No. No. Okay, my key power is shout. I can't remember how to do it, though. You gotta go to the menu. 93 experience. I've leveled up. Key is increased by 5. Power is increased by 3. Speed is increased by 3. Nice. I like that 5 Use on the key. key meter. Scream! The game doesn't do a great job of increased letting you... I'm gonna see, see if I can your, do that again. Uh, like how many key points? How many key points do I have left? I don't know. It'll tell you when you can't uh, do anything anymore. Uh, Leo. Okay, let's get off the screen with all these people before they decide to fight us to death. Nope, these people oh, are gonna fight course. us to the death. Yeah, because we were walking too aggressively. We yeah. kind of started this one. God, it's a huge crowd now, isn't it? I don't know if it's always going to be, but but that's what we're landing right now, which is not great. Especially when they've when they've mostly decided to focus on you. Okay, at least I think this is a Yumiko who I don't think is as strong as Yamada. Oh, in fact, it's not even the same type at all. But there's a there is a super strong red faced schoolgirl. A lot of the enemies uh, still just you know high school students. Or as public school students. Well, in some of the, one world. of those people, at least two of those people, look like middle-aged. But men. then every now and then, we're very clearly being attacked by like salary men, just here? like waiting for the train home from work. It's strange. Yeah, this is the one. Okay. So we want to just get on the train. Oop. No, Kiyomi. As soon as we can. Oh, it's just her. Well, I'll let you. Oh no. So why would you say that, James? Well, because. You know, getting I'm dead. Oh man, and that she wasn't even focused on you. No, she just like caught you with a lucky back elbow. Oh man. Well, do you want me to go back? Push Kitchen. forward. See how right. far you can get. Okay. There you go. You got her. Okay, this is never gonna knock her down, so it can't beat her. There you okay. go. 
62. Nice. More prepaid cash cards. Okay, so as soon as the train comes, you just want to get on it. Don't Worthy. jump off the platform. Just wait for the train. There you go. Okay. And just get on. There you go. Okay. And now we're going to see the train hit a bunch of people who are walking on the tracks. Or possibly not. Hopefully not. Well, it's their own fault for walking on the trip. Nope, I just heard it hit somebody. Well, the, the infrastructure design here could be doing more to discourage that kind of uh, dangerous transit behavior. Who the hell am I? I'm a guy. I just got off the subway, lady. <laughs> I haven't done anything to you. This guy came out of nowhere. <laughs> You're in a subway. This is public transit. God, it's around you on all sides. Yeah, which is just like, that's part of the fun in the original Renegade is that it's like, you know, you're fighting a whole gang, but they're doing like, you know, things like most of them don't want to attack you all at once. Sometimes they kind of seem cowardly. They're a little more standoffish. Oh yeah, the ones who like run in and out Yeah. the original. But like, uh, that's the, like th there's the move set there's... in that game is way better tailored to that kind of fighting because yeah. you have the default kicks that are targeted behind you. They've gone down to a single attack button scheme here, which is not conducive to uh, managing these tricky fights. Okay. Even, oh, like, nope. Nope. it's a pretty big move set. They did a good job of only using one button. All right, I beat them all. I'm also, are we sure that this actually, that this train took me anywhere that we, that yeah. isn't where we just were? You want to go upstairs now? There you go, see? Shinsaibashi, yeah. okay. Ah, oh, man, no, I don't. There was a place in Shinsaibashi we tried to go before that we weren't able to because we had not triggered that. Uh... Yeah. So presumably now we can. Now we've triggered it, so we can we can move on. So you have to go to the right, I think. All right. Well, I'll try that as soon as I finish beating up all of these locals. Yeah. The people of Osaka yeah. are fight-happy people. Like... All of these people, you're telling me this middle-aged man here with his hands in his pockets is in the student union gang? No, this is a random battle. This is not necessarily a plot battle. We could, like, this guy just had a bad day and he sees this kid nice. and he's like, fucking good-looking kid, thinks he's so good-looking. I used to be good-looking. And then it's on. Hey, eight, not bad. Not bad. Shinsei Bashi underground. underground. Okay, here I go. But yeah, then this, uh. They're trying to put spice back in their marriage. Yeah. By just <laughs> ambushing youths. Somebody hail! You started this! Yeah. We, it's, Kunio it's... did nothing to you. I will say, I appreciate how rarely, if ever, I don't know if we've ever seen their calling for reinforcements thing, summon reinforcements. Nope. Which is a, a kind of plays into the theme of the low social trust that exists in uh, this universe's Osaka. Nice, you got him. Was that hurt now? She's got a sliver left. Oh! Stop it, lady. There you go. Just because your husband is unconscious doesn't mean you can just... You're raking up the experience without me here. Yeah. I'm leaving you in the dust. I'm sorry, Miyoko! Are we cool? Are we cool? We're... No. She's getting out of here. But I understand why these guys want to attack me. Yeah, you just... As far as they can tell, I just randomly attacked some lady. Oh, uh, I only just noticed that sometimes the diffident kicks are like up kicks and sometimes they're down kicks. Yeah. Oh, oh you walked man. into it. 
Oh. Oh man, this this guy is just like a this guy works somewhere in the subway system. He shouldn't be getting the drop on me. I like that that like stuns him for a second. Yeah, the thrown weapon. Ah, oh. uh, you missed it. I have no idea why that would miss. No, but... you. Fe it feels very much like you were on the right axis. Thrown uh, weapons uh. don't seem to do much damage, or at least none of the ones that I've connected with do. But they do do that stun, so they have their own tactical purpose. Mm. Oh come on! There you go. Okay. Got him with a hold. Got some experience. Keep on going, please, folks. Please, please. I think the insult to injury... Okay, I'm oh. clearly supposed to be going up somewhere. Alright. Looks like you've got guts. Yep, going outside in Osaka. <laughs> Pretty much the bravest thing any person can do. Oh, well, no. That's it. But she's one of the uh, Psycho Naka backhand slappers. Kunio, Kunio, are you okay? Snap out of it! I found you on the street! Boom. You oh, snapped okay. out of it. There's no penalty besides your own inconvenience for losing. Yeah. But boy, is it inconvenient. <laughs> yeah. Because now we got to do all the random encounters again. Those aren't cleared. Real dirty move that you're not allowed to flee. Hello, Guided by Voices. Same hotel room game. Yep. This is a long-running series with a, a lot more variation in its other entries. Than I'm just a regular thing. guy. I just got a suitcase like a regular guy would. We're just Why are we not men. going out? We're just innocent men. Uh, door's not working, so that's... Wait, because we went to the first floor, not the parking garage. Ah, uh, they look very similar. You can't just... Obviously, you can't travel above ground. Okay, Kazuki's on our side. Ah, this is going to be a pretty easy fight. Because... So, these are just guys from my school. There. Do they not know? Like, the deal? Yeah, I don't know. And like, that dude... Like, he looks like he's been in high school a while. He's got the hair <laughs> of a... of a very stressed out guy in his late 30s, early 40s. So, I do have a guide, I will say that, to anyone watching. Because sometimes the uh, the actions that we are supposed to be taking are not really laid out by the game in any meaningful way. I, well, I think if we were paying a little bit closer attention to the uh, well, to we're the supposed to dialogue. We're scenes. supposed to call somebody on a payphone when we get to some. To, uh, yeah, to and like them. I'm pretty sure that like something like that has been communicated to us in strategy sessions, but. Probably it was, a, it was a good move, Greg, for you to... Oh, come on. We were right there. Atsuko, this isn't fun. We we have more important fights to engage in. Ah. Okay. I gotta... This thing... I gotta be letting you do more fighting. I so mean, that... if, you, if you get experience points and can take some fights, that's fine too. I'll pick it up where I can. Let me get the final hit, though. That's all yeah. that matters. Well, with these ones, it was just there, there was no distinction There's between when yeah. I knocked them down and when it was all over. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Gotta watch out for her. Yumino might be insanely tough. No, he's okay. Uh, I meant the, the woman behind you. But it actually appears like she's a little more reasonable. Oh, and in fact, Yumino was not the She was nothing. Me. But also, I, I, I took. Oh, the, shoot. The I one. did get a lot of my. Uh, my uh, HP taken away there, though. Yeah, that's what I thought her character was like. She or maybe I might have actually done some friendly fire by mistake there, too. Okay. Down. And now we can actually the take train. the train if the people... Okay. Don't try to fight by the pillar, Greg. No. There we go. Oh, he had a bottle. He was trying to bottle me. He was just trying to enjoy a beer on a subway, and then you had to look at him. Ruin his day. <laughs> yeah, here I was, minding my own business, when this kid comes into the subway. So I throws my bottle at him. 
<laughs> Famously written by George Harrison after he got sick of rabid Beatles fans pelting him with bottles. Saying, bring out Paul! Bring out Paul! Alright, wait for- okay, here comes the train. Let's not have a fight start. Get these people off the screen. No! We can't get on the train when there's a fight. Will the train leave while we're fighting? Sure will. Sure will, James. Goodbye, train. Quick, 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 Greg, scream. Nah, I'm good. Okay. I'll scream now. Well, at least nobody could get off the subway train and attack us while the battle was going on. Once again, I took the lion's share of experience. Sure did. Just gonna scream again. It's the, uh... It's, actually, it's the conundrum of all RPGs that award experience only to the killing blow. Yep. Which is that as your character... Uh, once a character breaks out in a lead, it, it compounds It, it becomes, itself. yeah... Insurmountable. Here we go. Right. Okay. I like the the train leaves on its own schedule. It's not gonna yeah. go it's just because the player character has got on. That's not. Uh, people like, busy fighting on the platform. Or people wait. getting into the other entrance. Yeah, the the conductor had to hop off and just slug some dude. Soccer's a tough town. Tough town. the stairs okay okay so we have to find a payphone there were some payphones I think oh oh man come on I didn't want to start anything Alright, you've actually got the high value enemies going. I'll swoop in. <laughs> Damn, got me. And I like experience based character progression. And it like it does add something to any beat em up structure to to have it. But it's, like, we're just, we're both the same character on the same track. We will get yep. the same things at the same levels. We'll never make a choice about how we develop. Hey, and I leveled up. It could be cooler. Your HP didn't go up at all. Hello, strike. Though. Our stats don't go up in the same increments. No. Although we, we do will seem, be different we learn the same the things end. at the same times. Chanel. Well, that's channel. Channel. This is fun, huh? Maybe if you haven't been doing it all day. Oh, wait. Somebody's oh. friendly. Captain Yama started the fight. And then became friendly. Yeah. He picked a fight with them. He or she. I don't know which one. Okay, yeah. It's the guy in the suit. One of them. There's two dudes. I hit him. Because I had no choice. Yeah. Well, listen, involved. he shouldn't be... He was just getting his ass kicked. He wasn't going to help us in the long run. Hee <laughs> hee, what gives? I think he's still on our side, despite you uh, huh? literally knocking him out. He gives experience either way. This is the guy that... Oh, that's the guy who was on our side. Never mind, so he had turned on us. And you'll definitely get a, a good chunk of experience for him. Because he has a... At least I hope, because he's got crazy defense. It's taking forever. No, no this come is, on. This is, there's nothing funny about this at all. You can get in and help until he's down to his last little, like, bit. Yeah, I suppose you're right. There you go. Wow. Yeah, I'm just doing way more damage than you right now. Yeah. You're just open. I, I think you're, like, two or three levels ahead of me now. Yikes. And likewise, you, you take a ton more damage than I take. Which is probably as much about maximum hit points as... Oh yeah, I think I'm just taking bigger slices of the same pie here. There 
There we go. Nope. This guy. He's like locked onto you though, so that helps. Yep. Could just. Alright. Amazing. Yep. <laughs> that would have been. Uh, Level up. <laughs> amazing. Well, find these pain phones. Pin punch. Pin punch. Ooh, know. do you think that's getting down on somebody when they're on the ground? It better be. That's exactly what it sounds like, and it's not a key power. Okay. Here's some payphones. This is a payphone? Doesn't. Oh, yeah. yeah it's got that's a phone, a phone symbol right next to it. Are you hitting A? Yeah. So. Oh, well, there it goes. Use the phone? Yes. Did he, was he saying that to us? Yeah, I think he's breaking the fourth wall. <laughs> oh. Kooji? It's just me. Uh, just a Chinsai Ibashi. That's it. Oh. Did this interrupt the cut screen? Motherfuckers. Or is this... I believe that we just... It better not have broken the game. There. Anger strike. I was on the phone, buddy. Holy shit. You're wrecking house now. Yeah, you gotta get... Uh, once you gain some levels, we'll be cruising. Or I'm just gonna get on the run of a lifetime, man. Beat the game with you. I'm fine with that. I'm in a busy day. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, there we go. Okay, you got over one more hit. Boom. Okay. Use the phone? Yeah. Is it gonna pick up? Oh. Kooji? It's just me. Where are you? Oh. Where are you now? Where are you now? Uh, I can do it. Just at uh, Shinsei Bashi. That's it! Oh. My god. Yeah, this is uh... Can you change the speed of that conversation? I don't think I, I am skipping... I, I will... I will check next time. If I have any option to make it go faster. That's part of the strategy here. It doesn't say anything in the guide, but like you'll no. be constantly attacked while you try to use the fucking phone. <laughs> it book. just says in the middle of the, the phone. in the middle of the dialogue. What's the matter? I can't breathe. That's I like that that spawned specifically when he was kicking me in the ribs on the ground. Mm -hmm. Use the phone. Yes. Yes, absolutely. Oh, Kooji? Hit all buttons. It's just me. Yeah, there's... I can't. There's nothing. Where are you now? Um... um stop just, uh, pausing! Like That's, That's it. it! Oh. That's just the whole conversation. I've told him now I'm at Shinsei Bashi. That's it. That's all I called for. Alright, we'll head out to the street. Yep. Yeah. I thought I were on the street. No, you're not on the street. You're underground. Right. Okay. Well, the fact that I can tr trash these goons now is gonna help the cause. Right. This is how I got to the street where I was immediately right. knocked out. Shinsai Bashi Street. Some of this might be the uh, fan translation too. Yeah. Okay, there's a way back in. Here's a medical tent. Parking garage. It's all the way to the left. Okay. Oh, you're doing it. You're killing it now. Somebody help! Somebody help! Oh, somebody help! Ma'am, come on. Yeah, you got it. I'm the person most likely to help you because I'm not from this wretched city of Osaka. The parking garage. I heard there's some characters gather around here. You one of them? <laughs> no. There's no entry past this point. What if there is the? No, oh, no. He won't stop you from passing him, but he will stop <laughs> the screen from flipping when you go beyond its border. Okay. Okay. Well, hold on. 
Can we have the dialogue again? Yes, we can. Alright. One of them? You one of them? Matter of fact. Heh <laughs> looks like you got guts. There we go. Now we can fight. What are you doing? Go I scream? am going to... Strike? I've never used strike, but I I assume it, it will increases raise your striking my power? striking power. Clench the fist. Kunio's attack power has increased 20. Oh. So that might also be something that can help you catch up and experience. Making more use of Kai powers. This won't do. Ooh. Jesus. Oh, he's a huge dude. Attack power voted, so it's short. Oh man, I have not. Oh, you're not impacting his his health at all. And he killed me in one shot. I certainly, I, I, my guess is going to be that that's not what we're supposed to do. Yeah, like, die in one shot now. That might be a much later in the game thing. Okay, well, back to Shinsaibashi. Let's stop in the other hotel rooms on the way out in case a scene just happens. Okay, yeah, fair point. It'd only be on this floor, so... No. No. Huh. I think <laughs> you can feel... Thanks, Kind of My Voices, for believing in us. Yeah. I think that it, any moment there, his health bar was going to decline at least a pixel. Yeah, one pixel. Six or seven more knockdowns. At least one pixel, if not two. Alright. You want to start something? No! But whatever. Boom. Oh, come on, dude. There you go. I gained five experience. Good. <laughs> Good. That's the goal. We're grinding. We're Greg grinding. We're Greg grinding? It's all one word. Yep. We're grinding. All okay. the way over here to get to the train. Even if we just had like a... You ever played Earthbound, Greg? No, I haven't. Well, in Earthbound, uh, it's uh, the style of RPG uh, combat it uses. It's not random, but instead you can see the enemies on the map. Yeah. Uh, and if, if you can try to avoid them and stuff. But also, when you are significantly over-leveled to an enemy on the map, if it approaches you, there's just a push, and then it just tells you the experience you get. You don't go nice. to fight. Yeah. Something like that. Or just like, you know, at a certain level, the goons in your own hotel that you can now just knock out with a single punch don't constantly start fights. They have no hope of winning. The people of this universe should really be used to uh, quickly sizing up an opponent. Uh, we're gonna have to wait for the next train now. That's okay. Waiting for the train is not the tedious part. Oh, damn it. Ah, took your knockout, but she has, did it to protect you. Yeah, no, I, I, I appreciate the protection. Excellent. There we go. All right, hopefully he was more valuable. Hell, he was, yeah. yeah twice as that valuable. That was, you know, level-based, which would be nice, but unexpected from this game, honestly. Come on, 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 quick, 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 quick. There are several <laughs> women on this subway platform. You've got to let us on. You've got to let us on. <laughs> they are going to break into a fight at any moment. Look at all these people just walking around on the bay platform. It kind of is. The people of Osaka are not getting a good reputation from this game. No, no. I, I hold, I think the theory of just like Homer Simpson doesn't like New York because he had a really bad day there once. Yeah. I think that's basically what happened to the developers of this game. They just had a really horrible time in Osaka. Day, bad day trip to Osaka and that was it. So, I'm pretty sure you have to fly or take a boat to Osaka. Huh. 
It is, an, it is a chain of islands on the end of Japan. One of these ladies is on our side, but I don't know which one. They're dancing a, uh, a delicate ballet of violence here. Okay. It's her, because both of them are attacking her. Yeah. Oh, but she's getting me with... Friendly fire. Friendly fire. And, I think we just confirmed, which is kind of disappointing to me, that when you have someone in an arm lock, the other person can't punch them. Let's beat this up a little bit. There we go. Oh, man. Stop that. Yeah, no. Whatever Come you're on, doing, folks. I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't care if there's a legitimate fighting reason to do it either. Nice. Okay. Don't explain to me how it works. Just stop <laughs> it. Just knock it off. Alright, so let's head. Oh, yeah, and then to the right. We'll head outside again. We might as well get outside at the first opportunity. Wait, can we interact with these things? Nope. Why? Nothing happens. Okay. What about this ticket window? No. It's gotta be what somewhere where we can spend all of these uh, prepaid cash cards. You wanna head over here? Dainau. Shinsei Bashi Street. Here we are. Out in the streets. That's just the other exit, eh? Yes. Maybe. We're somewhere different. Who the hell are you? But why do the others start the fight? You know what I mean? It's like, it's just a, you know, it's like... It's a communal thing? It's like, like when a dude charges again. the pitcher and everyone comes pouring out of the dugouts. It's just, it's instinct. So I, I gotta, I've gotta use strike as much as I can here. Yeah. Just to like... I mean, the ship eating out of me. I still haven't actually tried, now that I think about it, to use my, uh... Pin punch. There. Breaking arms over here with my really, really strong arm holds. Oh no! Yeah. Well, it's. It was, gonna, it was bound to happen. I got in there. I got some experience. Next time I'll get even more. Yep, it's true. That's the right attitude. Just throwing briefcases. Ah! I don't know if pin punch is what it just seems like it should be. It could be that this guy's just too, uh, too tough. Scream! Apparently we have to wait till it's afternoon. Oh, time of day matters. Time of day matters. But otherwise we're just on the street? Yep. Does time just pass or do we have to be switching screens? Time passes. Okay. Well, in that case, I'll stand perfectly still. You can change the time in the hotel room. Yeah, got it by voices is correct. Right. Well, well, then you have to get back here. Yes. An obscene okay. amount of Oh, time. the sun is setting. And also, this is a busy street. Oh, yeah, it's getting darker. You can... So you're going to have to wait around for a while. Oh, uh, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that the encounter rate is higher and fights are harder. At night? That's probably true. Okay. Makoto's on our side, so at least one of these women I don't want to beat up. But it's impossible to know which. That one. Yeah, okay. It's the one there who's hugging a dude. Yeah. All right. Well, she can work on that. Oh, great. This Kazuko has infinite health. Well, not infinite, but lots. Hey, Oh, nice. she killed him. Nice. Well, she is, there's something more than hugging going on there because that man is dead now. Ah, oh, man, but I'm finished too. Scream. I'm going. Ah! I'm going <laughs> for it if I press I the right the games. buttons. Yeah. Eight is not a lot of hit points though. No. But you got more key. Gotta make yourself stronger. Ah, no. no. <laughs> Useless, pointless. Okay. And we're back. But how do we know what time it is? 
How do we know what time it is? Just based on the sun, I think. But I mean, inside the hotel room, there are no windows. I don't know. Or does it, is it like... All right, there you go. I think we just sleep and that changes it from day to night. But yeah. We have to go outside before we can know what time of day it is. Oh man. Yeah. It's it's I I I I would say it's bad game design. This game needed more time in the oven. Mhm. Mm it is definitely of all the Kunio games we've played so far. The my least favorite. Yeah. I would say that it is my least favorite Kunio game. Easily. And it's still not like... Like, I don't feel like I felt when we played Battletoads in Battle no, 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 no. It's not, it's not on that level, but man... It's, it's just... It's also the, like... Man, this could have been really, really, really good. Yeah, there could have been something here. But why? <laughs> I love that big haymaker punch. The big punch is good. Like the animations for the moves are satisfying. It's a good little move set. It's. I wish I knew what this pin punch is. Well, have you tried it yet? I mean, I've tried what would do the pin someone down and punch them in the face in other games. Next time I'm dead, I'll look up on the, uh, I'll look up on the thing with the, yeah. what the moves I'll do. <sighs> Take that! That guy. Oh, it's the bottling guy again. There you go. What's the matter, you? Uh oh. Ichikawa's got his anger strike on. Oh, well, he's dead now. So, now that we know that the move called strike raises your attack power, I think we can safely conclude that anger strike is just a state in which your uh, attack Rain power is point to obtained. Okay, Hold well, on. great. What is that? Hey. Zone 1 commuter pass. We should try one of these and see if it takes us somewhere. Bainai's pointer. Okay. It might be equipment. Might be equipment. Okay. These, these ladies... Oh, god damn it. It's not even the ladies. Just too random. It's never the people you most expect. So I started King's Quest for The Perils of Rosella on the weekend, Greg. And uh, this game is, uh, among other things, famous for starring a girl, uh, yeah. Princess Rosella. She's on a King's Quest. Now I've seen everything. And. Sea monkeys obtained. So, as you probably gathered, the King's Quest game puts a lot of stock in using fairy tales uh, as as basis for its world and the characters in its world, and then asking you to apply fairy tale logic often to solve the puzzles. Mm -hmm. So early on, uh, some of the fairy tale characters that appear in this game uh, include the seven dwarves. Uh, and in my case, good guys, good guys. I first encountered this by going into their home. As you, I guess you can also meet them at the mine where they work. Hold on, Si. I'm just gonna see. It is, but this is also the game where you have to look at your stats. Yep. Before and after. So let's see. Could you remember, James? Oh, man. No, I couldn't. There's not a chance. One James second. is going to get a pencil for it. A, a pencil piece of paper for it. Okay, here. Okay. So it's 24. Uh, starting for... I'll oh, just do them all. Just do them all. 
Twenty-four, thirty-five, twenty-four, thirty-four, thirty-six, eighteen, one twenty-eight. Okay. Equipped. Also, most of the equipment that we've acquired. All in this of the game equipment so we've acquired so far. Oh, not all of it, but most of it has reduced our stats when equipped, which has been frustrating. Let's see. Oh, I think my attack went up. Your attack went up by three. Okay. Did anything go down? Ah. Uh, Wait! No, never mind. Your attack had been 36, and now it's 27. Oh my god. Just enough. You know, unless, like, items secretly level up, in which case, what the hell, game? Come on. Wait, even Brass Knuckles lowered your attack? You're yeah. back to 36. Try equipping the Brass Knuckles. Thirty-nine! Okay! Alright, now we're cooking. And here we are in Shinsai Ibashi. You might want to scream a little there, Riki. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, so you come across their home, which of course is in, is in great disarray. Yeah. And so can you see how the game's uh, groundbreaking feminism is about to come into contact? Uh, is going to come to conflict with its fairy tale logic and references. Do you have to clean the house? Oh yeah. And I, I, I cracked this one pretty quick. I was like, hey, it's their house. And the description's all like, what a mess. So I just typed clean into the text parser and it triggers like a 45 second animated cutscene of, uh, of Rosella running around just cleaning these assholes entire home for them. At which point they come home and eat a meal and then leave without clearing their dishes. Uh, but they do leave behind a poach of diamonds. Nice. Which? Wait. What the hell is going on? Why are they fighting? I don't know. If, I don't know if that's fighting what they're doing. But when your enemies are distracted, oh, oh, never mind. No, she was on our side. <laughs> no hot feelings. That's yeah. good. She understands. Okay. Son of a bitch, it's night! Alright. Well. Let's just hang out. Let the trouble come to us. It is still getting darker, oh my god. No, oh, it's gonna get pitch black. We're not even gonna see any of the characters anymore. Get the anger strike on. There! Yes! Yeah, you're doing it! You're you, doing it! There's a button press involved now, but okay. And also, I don't love that this random goon was able to toss me off. Well, that didn't... Uh, the, he was <laughs> able to kick out of my pin. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I would mean, also be James, he did what he did. It, I'd also be uncomfortable if random guys on the street would just kind of toss me off. <laughs> like, yeah. So there was still truth even in the, in the thing right. that I said by mistake. That, that netted me some experience. 150. Come on. Make you level up. Nope. Nope. Okay. It doesn't seem to be getting darker anymore. It's getting brighter. It's getting brighter. So now we gotta wait for the afternoon. And then cutscene happens somewhere? Head to the right. If it's the afternoon, a cut screen will start. Hey. So right of where you Unfortunately, time doesn't seem to pass while you're occupied fighting like five absolute psychopaths. Oh, no, 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 no. no. Oh, she got you. There was no way. There was just no way. Holy shit, that's... 
<laughs> it's a ton of them. <laughs> Toss them off! Oh my god! You're right about five psychopaths. There! Broke that old lady's my... arms for what she did to my buddy Ricky. Oh no, it was the other one. Oh no. This one can kill me instantly too. And now they're calling for help. Somebody help! We only have a four on one <laughs> advantage on this kid whose friend we just killed. <laughs> Oh, fuck. The hits to the back of the head hit you hard. Okay. I'm gonna try to stay alive here, but... Just advance the plot even a, even a little. I, if the subway system... Best of luck, guided by voices. I've been slaying the spire, or rather, no, failing to slay the spire okay. recently. I'm not great Let's with the have... ironclad. Let's just go. Okay. Let's run, go. run, run. Yeah. Hold on. Actually, I want to try it on him first. Let's yeah. just see. Oh, yeah. I, I think that was just a key pass that we needed to have so that we go through turnstiles. Right. Okay. Later, I stumbled my way through the Frog Prince puzzle. Nice. Uh, later to find out that if I had read the Frog Prince more recently or even bought, like looked it up on Wikipedia when I realized I was being asked to reenact it, I could have actually just solved the puzzle very easily. Because what you have to do is you have to... get into a hotel fight. You found a, you found a golden ball somewhere, and you have to drop the golden ball into the pond where you can see the weird little frog with the tiny crown. And then he'll retrieve it for you, and when he brings it to you, you can pick him up. But if you just try to pick him up, he just swims away. And I figured that out because I didn't have that many items yet. And so I was just like, well, I don't know, what do you like? A... I'll try to give him different items and see if he wants to come. And so when I said, give gold ball, Rosella just like dropped it and he picked it up. And I was like, okay, all right, well, I mean, fine. Kind of random. No, it's not random. That's just actually the inciting incident to the prince, the girl meeting the frog in the Frog Prince. Oh. She drops her gold ball and he retrieves it. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. But fair play, Roberta. That was very clear puzzle design in hindsight. Oh, I can take this guy pretty good. There we go. I can hit old man in the back of the head. Yep. That's me 15 sweet experience points. Yeah, the enemies in this area are no longer scaling to the kind of experience demands we're putting out. Mm -hmm. Okay, come on, just let us leave. Just let us leave. Nope. One more. One All more right. again. Well, given that they aren't scaling to the experience demands, I guess there's no reason I shouldn't just be knocking these dudes out. Well, any little bit helps. But that's also true in the sense of moments of our life that we save. <laughs> <laughs> Finish these battles sooner. Nope, you guys are gonna watch us grind just, pointless just, fights. Just, just be cool. Impossible gentlemen. for us to tell what time of day it is because we are entirely inside for huge stretches. No, nothing is funny. No, I can't remember the last time I sincerely laughed, sir. You're gonna make us miss this train. Seriously, the, the smartphone era is going to be great for this uh, for Osaka, Japan, and this universe. But just I got a taxi car. Just everybody, can, they're like all those really hackneyed art pieces you constantly see getting shared about like such a profound piece of because it's just like like you know look he this asshole painter painted a bunch of people on his phone on their phones because aren't we a terrible culture now? Uh, that exact art is like aspirational art in this version of Osaka. <laughs> Look at all these people ignoring each other. Not violently fighting just, with each other. Just reading the news while they wait for the subway. <laughs> Watching TikToks. God. Gonna let us off right at the end of this platform. Not gonna let us. 
Is it actually necessary for us to go to the end of the platform, given that the door is open everywhere? Mm hmm. We can try getting on an earlier thing and see if it, it see saves if that helps. us. Could in theory save us a fight or maybe two. Alright, I softened this guy up for you. Thanks, boss. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh shoot! God damn! This guy's got he's red got hands. He's got and blows. I interrupted it. Okay. I should scream though. Yeah. I feel like two solid hits could take me out at this point. You have no mouth, but you must scream. God damn it! Stop calling for help! You're kicking my ass! Alright, there. Jeez. No, don't suddenly get behind me. At least he didn't take advantage of his temporary advantage over you. There we go. Okay, come on. Riki level up. Riki level up! Woo! Woo! I would have liked to see you get more hit points. Me hey, too. Power four. Speed four? I'm faster, I'm stronger. Can scream a bunch. I dislike that it's a random amount. And <laughs> that it seems to be a D10. Like, yeah. come on. Hey, 10! I'll take it. Let's go. Please, God. It's yes, exactly man. like my exact complaint about Pool of Radiance. It's really nice to get a spell beyond Cure Light Wounds for the later game. Alright, thank you for joining us, Katsuhito. Someone's gonna have to come and, like, make it clear to me why, who I'm fighting. Alright. That's Hannah. Mr. Hanya. You're done. Nagata Sam. Okay. Our buddy's taken out, so there's no guilt involved in just punching freely at anything that moves. Done. Well done. 20 for me, 87, 87 for you. For me. And a silver necklace. The soundtrack's pretty on point. Soundtrack's though. terrific. I'll say that much. Absolutely. It's the daytime! To the right, to the right, to the, to the right, right, to quick. the right, to the right. It's getting too late now, goddamn! Is this too late in the day now? Oh no. I bet it is. Well, at least time is not passing during these fights. Shit. But also, we're going to be killed. Oh, I'm going to be killed. The difficulty progression is... No, like, there's a lot that's no good here. You got pain on your last level up, right? Yes. Okay. I'm taken in very, very quickly by that incredibly strong girl. And there you go. And we're back. All right. Hold well, on. let's go. Just... Don't. He's got infinite health, but that just makes it crueler, actually. <laughs> yeah, it does. Because he's not going to aggro. No. He's just going to take it and be like, okay. Sorry, just... guys. <laughs> I'll, try, I'll try to be cooler. <laughs> Is <laughs> that? It's bringing out a bad side of you. Um, okay. Okay. And away uh, we go. Well, here's the thought. I don't know that we need to finish this game to uh, fully appreciate its charms. Uh, yeah, I would agree with that, James. I think 
Unless, like, maybe it does something to win us over between now and the end of this session. But otherwise, I think two sessions is probably enough for us to render a verdict. Yeah. It really seems... What just happened to that hotel room? <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. You don't know. Maybe it's something between him and Riki. That's... I mean, it could be like a... Like Wheeler Yuta and the Blackpool Combat Club. Where he's their apprentice and they so they beat him up all the time, but he's like, thanks, because you're making me tougher. Yeah. I mean, that's, yeah. Yeah. That's I mean, what's Koji, happened. Koji's tougher now. He is. He Same took thing. some, he took his licks and he got back up. The thing is, we're so casual. Like, I know the hands in the pockets thing is, like, disrespectful, especially, like, in the era of Japan that's being depicted here. Yeah. But, like... It just makes us feel seem like we're the only people who aren't ra raring to fight. Yeah. In this whole city. In this whole perfection. Perfecture? I think I've heard it said perfection before. But it's U-R-E at the end, right? Yeah. Well, not everything's pronounced the way you think it is. I, I'll go with perfecture. I don't know. I mean, I, I've never heard that. makes sense. I've only no. seen it written. Perfecture. Sure. Huh. You got 108? I got Oh, 40. man. I, I don't know who was the high value target I took down. Yeah. This is a sort of weird area. Because we're not even to. We're not even to the train yet. So let's just get the train right at the. Let's front. trap. Let's. That might be a, a sweet hack. Mm hmm. So the guy does say go all the way to the left, see the policeman, and then go up the stairs and go right, and if it's the afternoon, you're golden. So we should visit the guy again and tell him we're not suspicious? Well, I, the, no, no, no. Yeah, you've done that. Yeah. That, that's happened. Okay. I just don't know if we're going too far right. Do you know what I mean? Like, maybe it's actually back a little more. But we and haven't even been there at the right time of day yet, so I don't want to say anything. No, and I'm not. I'm also not sure that that's the same Shinsaibashi Street. Cause when no, no I... there's only one Sh Shibashi Street. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. You just took... There's two exits to yeah. it. Yeah. You just took the exit closer to the, the phones. Okay. Okay, you know what? We're doing okay with the... Why not even like a key power called like chill that just lowers your random encounter rate for a duration? Yeah, I'd take that. Just, there's any number of things you could do for us, game. It's okay. getting darker. Yeah, but it... And also the light is changing inside, so we do have a proxy. It's just a lot less intuitive. And these fights are so much tougher on the straight. This is the furthest right we've ever been. But it's not afternoon anymore. I can go up these stairs. Hmm. Shinsaibashi. No street at all. It's nighttime now. There are no characters on this street. No NPCs. Okay, let's hang out here until it's day. Let's pass the time. So... See any good movies lately? Yes! I uh, yeah. I just watched, uh, I finally got around to Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Danielle yeah. and I watched that on Sunday, I think? Or possibly just yesterday? But I think Sunday. Uh, must have been Sunday. It was terrific. It was a strong film. Nice! Yeah. I, uh, I was a little worried, like, I, I knew the general idea that we're going to get a story about the la end of the golden age of Hollywood. Yes. Interspersed with the uh, the Manson family or the, the, Manson Tate, family. the yep. Tate murders. Uh, and because it's Quentin Tarantino. And I knew nothing more than that. So I was like, there's a chance here. And I was hopeful. Do you mind if I, like, spoiler warning everybody. Yeah, yeah. I know what you're going to say. Yeah, okay. Uh, like, but there's a chance here. Wonderful. That we're going to diverge from the from the history, like how yeah. the Inglorious Bastards killed Hitler at the end of that movie. Yep. But there's always a chance that we won't. 
And so I was getting filled with quite a bit of dread as that movie went on. Uh, and Margot Robbie was extremely charming as Sharon Tate. And just generally, I was like, I don't think, uh, I don't think uh, Danielle was adequately emotionally prepared. <laughs> when she was like, because we were going to watch a different movie. And she was like, I don't know, that sounds scary. What's, what's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? Uh, daytime, uh, yeah. We should head back. Yeah. Oh, go back? Yeah, well, I mean, the, I think the So cut it's screen, not Shinsei Bashi proper where I think the cut screen happens. happens here. Well, we'll find out. Unless we're killed. Yeah, unless we're killed right now. Okay, somebody's friendly. We can use this. Who is friendly? Impossible to say at this point. I believe it's the man in the brown shirt. But. Do you remember his name? It starts with an I. Yeah. Green shirt guy, definitely not our buddy. Yeah, it is the brown guy who you just took down, but I think... Wow, I couldn't really... I couldn't stop my punches! I'm sorry, my friend. Stop walking into my punches! Fortunately, they don't immediately aggro yeah. against you. They're like Dark Souls characters. You could accidentally hit them with a sword a few times, and they're just like, Hey, what? Oh! You gotta build that aggro meter before they're like, oh! So that's what it's all about then, eh? And then they'll fight you. Yeah, get in there! Yeah! Do some clubbing blows! Yes! My friend! Get in and help you? Now your turn! Go! Do she's, what needs doing! She's doing some trap conditioning over here. Okay, okay, okay. Brown guy. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, so Danielle was like, what, what's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood a bit? And I was like, it's, a, like, it's about the Manson family murders. She was like, oh, I want to watch that. And I was like, but you just said it would be being scary. And she was like, come on. I don't know. She, she was I like, had him, James. she was like, but she does like, like to watch like true crime stuff. And so, so I was like, okay, uh, we'll watch it. And then as it was going on, like, I was, when I realized, oh, Margot Robbie's playing Sharon Tate, I was like, oh, no. And she was like, why, what, who's Sharon Tate? And I was like, and eventually, like, she started you're saying, like, just like, Eventually, you realize like, she doesn't know anything what, about the Manson family. Yeah, what did yeah. the Manson family do? And I was like, oh, God, if this is depicted in the film, this is going to be very upsetting for Danielle. Uh, because I did not, like, when it turned out that it was an alternate history, I didn't fill in the blanks of being like, so here's how uh, Sharon Tate was horribly, horribly murdered. One guy? What if it says Ido became an ally and then the fight just doesn't happen? Nope. Fight's gonna happen. Oh, Dude, he's this really good, sucks. Big, so. Oh, man. Remotes writing checks. Okay. The no go other down, part of you try going downstairs the and then coming back up. You found a bird claw the pendant. The bird claw pendant. Okay. Time to suffer through this part. Alright. 51, 32, 36, 39, 48, 30, 128. Okay. Yeah, it says, when you are ready to continue the story, head to the right and climb the stairs. Head to the right. It was afternoon, a cut yeah. screen will initiate. Okay, so I think we were Head to the right and climb the stairs. The Shinsaibashi area that we were in. Okay. I think you're right. Definitely right. Uh... Whatever the thing is that we just got, I actually can't equip it, but brass knuckles are better than wristband. Sure as is. we discovered, so let's make sure that's always true. My attack is now 51. Great. Nice. Finally, I have a slightly better weapon. Okay. Just gotta survive a walk down to the other side of the street. Wait, I should go and not get in a fight with that policeman just to be safe. Oh! It's different now. Don't think you're supposed to be here. No. I have a feeling. Yeah, these guys are super tough. But it makes sense, because the policeman said toughs hang out here. Yep, he so sure did. Okay. He gave you fair warning. Oh, great. Five hit points with my screen. Okay, come on. Let's get some... Let's get it done. Clenched a fist. 20 is a huge increase. Yep. You're all kicking ass. Taking names? No. No, they're providing the names 
Okay, gonna, that's still gone. We do not have to earn the names at all. Nice, nice. It's just you and him now. Attack power reverted, but you know what, buddy? Ah. That good wind up, though. I keep getting to him just not in time. <laughs> well, I see a combo I can exploit here. Nice. Ah. Wow, you got him with that one, though. Nice! Woo. Yeah! Hooray! Hey, finally. Speed increased by two. The rich Key get increased. richer. Speed increased by one. Okay. Well. Oh, and now there's just businessmen down there. Just folks. Okay. Oh. We're going all the way to the right. Going all Knock the way it off, Kiyomi. Jeez. Jeez, ladies. Hey, well, at least we know where we're supposed to try to go. If we can never make it back again. Well, I mean, we're consistently making back, because now the only really hard fights are up here. Oh, these are hard fights. Okay, you're gonna, you're gonna die if you take one more slap. Yep. Ooh, that jump kick did not work out. I needed no. to get way more height before I hit kick. Okay, right. well. Well, at least we know where we go. On we struggle. We got at least a... We've got at least another half hour of this. Half an hour and 45 minutes more of this. And then we have... Not a half an hour and 45 minutes, Chance. When do you think we end? We usually end around 9.15. Do we not? Yeah, it's 8.24. Yeah, 45 minutes from now will be 9.15. You said half an hour and 45 minutes. No, half hour, 45 minutes. Like, I see. a range. Yes. <laughs> I was going to say, we don't have... Just we I didn't, don't I, have I, nine... I, just, I didn't say the hyphen out loud, but... <laughs> well, we've made a promise to the audience now. See? Greg. I'm sorry. But <laughs> Greg never stood by that. Yeah. Greg was always in defiance of that. Okay. Okay, okay. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, Well, at least... It, oh, no, there is a fellow there. Oh, no, never mind. He booked it. There we go. Boom. I will say I think this game's the biggest, the biggest, I think, con you can have for this game is that it makes you sad when a fight starts. Yeah. And this is a beat-em-up game. Yep. Like, the fights are the point of it. Yeah. And every time a fight starts, I think, uh, not again. <laughs> yeah, it's a, this is going to sound wildly tangential, but it's just like the stupid way that in professional wrestling they do fatal four-way tag teams where only two teams are allowed in the ring at once. So there's two yeah, guys there's wrestling. Two other guys, and if the yeah. other teams want to get in, they have to do like a, like a sneaky tag to like steal the guy's spot in the match. With the result being that you're taking what's supposed to be the big, you know, tension release pop moment where the crowd gets excited when a hot tag is made and a guy comes in and instead now every time someone tags in he's getting booed for being a cheap, like, doing it yeah. really bad. It should be four people in the and that's what they've done here. They have set up a system of rules where... The thing we should get excited for, most of the time, we're like, ah, because we Honestly, have to do so many fights that don't matter. If Yeah, if there was a fight every screen, I'd be fine with it. If yeah. it was the same amount of fighting, but it wasn't random, it was just like, whenever you saw people, you had to fight them. If you could run. Yes. If you could just run. If you could just run free. Okay. We're heading to that bridge, people. We're going to make it there. The good thing is we know we can just spend time there. There's no enemies. Yeah, so and which is especially good because it is getting darker right now. It is, yeah, I can see that on the screen. The day-night cycle is on the one hand pretty quick and on the other hand uh, not quick enough because of the fact that random encounters also are they're not on a step count. They're on just the clock. 
and they happen way more frequently than complete. Although somewhat data randomly, sets. though, because we haven't encountered one yet, and that seems odd. Holy shit, we're gonna make. What if there is like some? Un there, there could be some underlying rule that we're missing. Oh, you think we might be able to do the cutscene? I'm skeptical. No, I'm just seeing if there's an end to this. I just want to see what the okay. Here's the end. Okay, well, let's go back. Wait till it's day. Go downstairs, back up, and Sounds we'll head good. over. And perhaps we'll advance the plot. Yeah, that would be amazing. If okay, all, this is the end. even if even if nothing else was changed, even the random encounters, but we had a there was a quicker travel between yeah. the base hotel. And the start of the area we're in now, where we didn't yeah. have to slog through the hotel underground, into the subway, take the subway, get out of the subway underground. And it should be noted, the only way to save your game or heal is to return to the, the hotel. Like, yep. if, we were, if we were playing this in a strategic There's way, like, where we were like, our health's pretty low, we should go back to the hotel. Okay, let's go on a fucking... 15 minute journey there is back the taxi to the hotel. Car, there's the taxi card item that takes you right back to the hotel, but. Yeah. Then you have to get back. Why can't the taxi card item bring up a menu of a select number of fast travel points? That would not be beyond the bounds of design conventions or uh, technical capacity for this game at, at its time. We're getting there. But yeah. I, like, I had a feeling this game might be not as good as the other Kuniokun games we get. But I would not have made a bet that I would wind up proposing, what if we just didn't finish it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think this is probably daytime enough. I, it looks daytime-esque. Okay. There's a there's an air of daytime to it. Yep. Okay. Good, you came. I'm Oumi from Nola High School. I'm Soraya from the Old Girls Academy. And I'm Azawa from Ibisu High. And I join from Sakomayu. We make up the four most loyal alliance members. We may not be able to beat the Union alone. There are still tons of people who despise their harsh methods. The point's definitely worse than their already fierce bark. We'll need your help to put some pressure on them. Alright. If you can help us, we could pull through this. No, I think it was That was you. Boots. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Right. Voices. What plan? Although, you said that, and then Greg missed his line, so. <laughs> uh, to coordinate synchronized attacks at various locations, we could fragment the Union and destroy it. Okay, let's discuss our base of operations. We initially went with Shinsaibashi, but... According to the rumors, between Shinsaibashi and Namba is a connecting sewer. Hey, we've been there. We've been in a sewer. It's occupied by the Union. We don't know where the entrance is, though. We know. This girl's got a real serious contralto gun. Mm -hmm. She could be in a Shakespeare's sister cover band. It'll be well defended. Uh, I'm grouped with Saori, right? Fine by me. Anyway, what <laughs> one group should go through Namba so we can attack from both sides. That's a nice little character moment. Yeah. Of just the one dork who's like, do I get to be with... She turns around and gives him a look like, what the fuck? <laughs> 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 the, uh, the leader's like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Anyway, back on track. <laughs> we should go through Namba so we can attack from both sides. One group should go through Namba so we can attack from both sides. I'll go through Namba. No way. You can't go alone. It's too dangerous. 
Well, I'll go with you. All right. So, Kurio and Riki with Miho through the entrance at Yamada. The entrance is uh, uh, somewhere in the Yamada subway tunnels. Oh, we know, Zawa, but thank you. You need a key to get in. Speak of the devil. While I was in Yamada, I picked up this key. Alright, we've solved the mystery of the Yamada sewer key. Yeah. Sounds like that quest is over. That! That's it! It's the key! Yeah, you found it. It's good. Here you go, Kunio. Card key obtained. But the leader in Yamato is Hokuta, the bear. Or Hokuto. She is one of the four ringleaders of the Union. Be prepared to take her on. After the mission, should we come back here? Sure. Okay, let's get the show on the road. Mio, with Ota, right? Why's that? I ain't about to let a girl get into a fight she ain't gotta be in. It is good music, it isn't is it? It is good, yeah. Got my voices. <gasps> I understand. This should come in handy. Sakura lining obtained. Ooh, that sounds like an upgraded armor. Sakura. Bum 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 bum. What's this? Bum 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 ba ba bum. This used to belong to my older brother. Huh? Hey, Ricky's suddenly involved in the cutscene. Although I assume he's just taking dialogue like Kunio would have said. He's one of the four ringleaders of the union. Mizaki, the Hellraiser, is my brother. Didn't know who he was before he said his name! Oh. What?! <laughs> I'm taking a bag! Yeah. We can't believe it! Hold on, <laughs> the guy with all the fucking pins in his head is your brother? <laughs> <laughs> to put an end to the inter-school conflict and to further his homer harmonious ideals. The founding president created the Osaka Student Union. My brother was inspired by the leader and added himself to the Union's ranks. Then it's fine. Why did you turn out like this? Well, the Founder went missing. And now, we're left to deal with this. The I feel like that uh, those ellipses let out, left out a lot of detail. <laughs> the the yeah. A lot of causality was not really covered there. The current union leader is abusing his power, trying to bring all of Osaka under his control. Okay, there, here we go. The corrupt leader. Yeah. Lord British went missing. Blackthorn is now in charge of Britannia. He's ruthlessly <sighs> enforcing the virtues. I despise this violence that's erupted. And to think my brother is still a part of this union. You can't despise the violence that much. You live in this town. <laughs> yeah. Even knowing that it might mean deposing my own brother, I entered into the alliance. I mean, All right. <laughs> you're just teens. Huh? <laughs> I don't think that I'm making a mistake. Sorry for boring you with my story. Then, well, I'll be waiting at the hotel. Please come back for me. <laughs> That's what I assume the heart means. All right. Okay, let's take a fucking taxi. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Sakura. You want to try this the crew line? It might. If she gave it to you. Huh? Yeah. We both got it. We know where that is, and we have an item that takes us there. And now we have a quest that actually starts way closer to our starting point. Nice. Maybe this game will win us back for. So, what's week. my uh, defense up? To, is my defense up or down? Oh, it's significantly up. It's up twenty. Holy. Okay. Back. That should help the team. Uh... Find the taxi card. Oh wait, sea monkeys. Ah, uh, taxi card. Taxi card used. Wiki can't use this. Could? Do you have to use it? 
Maybe. If it says Kunio can't use this, then we're fucked. Well, it... It wasn't saying you couldn't use it. So, it might be we can't use it in this place. Okay, okay. Yeah, let's try let's going down to Shinshaibasi Street. Yeah. Because, like, a taxi can't come up here. Sure. But we've used the taxi car from the subway, and that isn't... Well, we can leave the subway. Yeah. Pretty easily. Can't leave this pedestrian bridge pretty easily. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, right. yep. Just can't use uh, it from there. First basement. We're there. No, we gotta go up. We gotta go talk to her at the hotel. She said oh, she was she... waiting at the hotel for us. Okay. I so thought she was just waiting for one of our missions. Over. We're on the third floor, right? Third or fourth. Oh, second. Definitely not fourth. Definitely not fourth. Alright, try a second. I mean, the worst that will happen when we get into a really low level fight. Extremely low level. There should be a stick in here? There's okay. a stick in here. Yeah, okay. we're in the right spot. Okay. So, where is she at? Yep, here she is. Pace in the room. What could those boys have gotten to? Welcome back! What are you doing here? You asked us to come here! No, man, I'm telling you, she was asking us to do that after we complete this leg of the journey. Okay. Alright, so we're heading down to basement. basement. Yep. And we're going into the sewers. We're going into the sewers. The Suez Canal. Was this the one? It was. Who the hell are you? You guys clearly go to my high school, and I'm the boss of that high yeah. school. Why? Well, it's, you know, it's, they're shooting the shot. You Cut gotta beat blows. the man to be the man. It's true. It's just not going to happen. And also, it's like, you know, he's with the hot-blooded tough guy, Kunio. <laughs> Really, just wait till you see him alone if you're going Here we to go. shoot sure. a shot. Okay. Excuse us, folks. Don't mind us. Okay. We're... Yeah, there's no way we're getting rid of this. But... <laughs> but these are still just losers. Boom. You slug him once in the back of the head with a rock. And he's out. Like Wait, these are super losers. This is not the right this sewers. This is not the right sewers. Great. Right. Good stuff. Well played. <laughs> Alright. Well, at least... This part this is gratifying. Is, this the is power reasonable. fantasy. It's yeah. not even the power fantasy, actually. It's just the... Uh, Should the... I be looking up where we're supposed to be going? Or do you think we can find the sewers? I don't know if we can. They're supposed but... to be in Yamada. We are in Yamada. So like we're in the right area. Yeah. For sure. For certain. So let's uh let's Well they said actually it's from the Umeda subway. Okay. So well, let's get to the subway. Alright, but is it from the underground or from the subway? Let's go to the subway first. Well let's go to the first. subway. The subway is definitely over here. I also, always feel better when I can figure it out myself. Two sets of, there's two sets of stairs. We usually go down the first set. So maybe we try the second or maybe we... I don't know. You know what? Let's try. We're at the station. Can we go to the washrooms? We cannot. Okay. Okay. This is something. Yeah, I, I can see... I mean, obviously not this song anymore. Uh, but the song before, I can see what you're saying kind of voices. So we don't want to get on the train here for sure. No, not getting on the train. But if there's like a utility door somewhere along the tracks. Okay. I will say I did read uh, in the previous section, if you do get hit by the train, it is instant death. Yeah. Which, you know, reasonable. That's, that's that, yeah. That checks out. Please stay off the subway tracks, folks. Okay. 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 Fortunately, Not this way. being electrocuted 
Hold not on. this way. Hold on. Is no, okay. Third rail, oops. Get right. off the tracks. Don't worry. Just oh, a little God. bit. I mean, electrocution is not what's happening here. It's just mild shock. But clearly, no, yes, electrocution is when you die. Yeah. Cution, like an execution. Mm hmm. So the other way then. I got 12 experience. Yeah. Okay, so let's go this way. We obviously don't want to go up. Because that's not how sewers work. Sewers are at least perpendicular to the... Yeah. To the subway. Ah, oh, man. God, you took forever to I'll get, get here, guy. Fukumoto. How? There we go. Hey, me too. Okay. The thing is, your method of a door makes sense to me. Of there being like an ooh, ooh, wait, wait, wait. Here, I train hear the train are coming. Do not get hit by it's that coming train. Coming around the bend. Okay, we should be safe with it. Hey. The secret sewer. I'm just a weird old man. Please don't talk to me. Excuse me, I gotta talk to you, sir. He doesn't want to talk. Dude. Try using the card? I don't think this is the right door. There's nowhere else to go in here. Let's go back out and find another door. Okay. Get off those tracks, though. Off okay. the tracks, quickly. I'm just a weird old man. Is that a door? I don't know if it's a door. It is, it's and it's a secretish door. Oh, okay. This is a usually assembly point, but I bet you knew that. Get ready. Okay. This is a fight now. Oh, somebody's on our side? No, I don't think so. Oh, I'm just... Ah. Green. Oh! Just a little one. Yeah, that was just good. Just a yell. Just a yell. advancing the plot and getting more prepaid cash cards that we don't know what to use on that's a door yeah on the way out sewer second basement oh, oh. we can finally get in the sewage Ooh. sorry that's all right that do a lot of damage to you enough that i'll do it on a screen but I was pretty badly damaged from the previous fight. Okay, we got two doors. I think we have three, actually. No, nope, well, that's I mean, the one we came technically, in. Technically, but... That's the one we came in. Yeah. First door. Alright, start with the left one. Who? Someone's coming! Who the hell are you? Is it just the sprites on screen, or is it because some people are fighting underwater if it's got everything chugging along? Well, it's not getting... Oh, I was going to say it's not getting any faster as we pick them up, but that's because the fight's actually refreshing. They're sending in new ones. But it's so far, it's mostly low-level goons. Your Shinjis and your... Aikos. 
Oh, your Mitsuko's. Oh, awesome! Uh, what 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 do you have going on in your build? Eek! There we go. That's a good one. Oh, sweet! Do you have a what is it? Accuracy or expert? Accuracy is it the one that makes your shivs more powerful? Other your shivs are all the ones that are zeros. Oh yeah, very, very nice. So satisfying. And then all the better if you can get that, uh... Oh, get something. I think it's snake bite or, like, there's a... There's a relic that makes all your unblocked attack damage add one poison. Wait! Someone's coming! This is making me feel like we're actually approaching a boss because the last time yeah. we did a boss was the subway and it was this sort of laid out Bunch gauntlet. Of to get there, yeah. Unlike the like sort of unintentional gauntlets that going anywhere in this game creates. Yeah. Oh, you got him. Whoa. Erupting from the sewage. Whoa. Walked right by me. You know what? I will say this. Osaka's uh, wastewater treatment must be pretty good. That is some transparent sewage. <laughs> A little purple. Oh, Kunio, you, yeah, you need to scream. Oh. This guy's pretty tough. Yeah. It's a lot tougher than the other guys. You were tiny. I'm getting him, though. I don't know if there's any relation to Mayu. No, no, no. It would say HELL RACE! <laughs> <laughs> DROWN! No, I, Mayu, like Mayu Iwatani, the professional wrestler. Oh. I thought you said, I thought you said Miho. You were thinking of Miho. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Cutscene City. Oh, this is it. So annoying. Oh, what you doing any here anyway? What is it with you? Didn't I see you the other day? <laughs> yes, you're so trying to leave well enough alone. That's the way she sounds. Okay. Oh man, <laughs> this Sakuto. I don't know what to make of her. Ah, oh, fives. Get out of here with these fives. Excellent boss music, Sakuto. Ah, hey, the reviews are in. That's yeah. sounding like a weird Adam Sandler impression really <laughs> really spikes the needle. It's often been said that Adam oh Sandler my God. is our greatest Look at her ever. health. Yeah, she's a tough one. Uh, you might want to put up a strike. This is a terrific song. Oh, that, oh yeah, that's doing it. That's the key. Just, just absolutely waste her with the strike power. Yeah. Okay. Done. Mental net. Yes. There we go. There's some playing. That's some what Ricky needed. Okay. I finally learned pin finally punch. On the pin punch. Oh, I got boxing gloves. I bet those increase. And granny sandals. Nice. All right. All right. Better get going. Yeah? <laughs> Should we chase that dweeb? Uh... Maybe. Yep. Chasing the dweeb was the right move. Yeah. Hey pal, guess what? Got nowhere to run. This weird holding box room. You got a problem, punk? I should do them. You, you're not from the 
the union, are you? Yeah. Seriously? Yeah. Seriously? Seriously? Yeah, seriously. Sheesh. I'm saved! And I'm Yubi from Ibisu High. Huh? Iwa Azawa from the Alliance asked me to search the sewers between Shin Sabashi and Nanba. Something went wrong in the translation here. Because at the start, I thought the Kunio was bluffing that he was in the Union. Yeah, but now it seems like this guy thinks he's in the I Union. I think he was asking, I think Kunio was supposed to be reassuring him that he was not yeah. in the Union. But I got caught by the Union! So are you in the Alliance? Right! Okay, because that was not clear. Yeah, that was not clear before. Oh, I better go and report to everyone. You really saved our hides back there. Well, specifically yours. Yeah. Alright, there you go. So, um, are we supposed to go to the hotel room or to the bridge? Uh... Well, let's go to the hotel room because at the very least we can heal. Yes. And then let's go to the bridge. We're back on track. Oh, come on. We kicked you people out of this sewer. Well, I guess worst case scenario, we get knocked in. It's just a quick trip home. Yeah, that's true. Back to our room. Oh, well, that's it. Now that we're back to parody and levels, I want to get more experience. Boom. Also, we got to try out our boxing gloves and granny sandals. Oh yeah, do you want to do that? Yeah, once I'm done with the deco here. Oh, Ricky, I'm sorry. Well, I mean, you've got a sliver of health left. You want to try to make it back? <laughs> yeah, okay. Try okay. the, gr try well, the you gotta gr Check your stats, I knew. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Because I've leveled up. You've leveled up, much. yeah. Or have I? My agility is 40. Holy smokes. Okay, fine. I'll update the numbers. So right now you've Not got the brass step. knuckles, the tree lining, and the canvas shoes. 41, 40, 56, 30, 128. Hey, right. I think I'm back invested for at least one more session. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because we made some progress. We're making progress. I will say this. Actually, you know what? I will say this. The cutscenes really add a lot to the game. They're fun. When, when, the longer you go between cutscenes, the worse the game is. Yeah, definitely. All right, what the granny sandals do for you? Uh, well, my agility is... Oh, hey, yep. My agility went from 40 to 65. That's pretty good. These, uh, you can really move in these granny sandals. Do you want to try the boxing gloves over the brass knuckles? Yeah, I might as well try them. I assume they are better. Just when you thought you were out. They pull us back in. They pull us back in. With this compelling plot about a well-meaning society gone wrong. When the idealistic leader with the original vision was no longer there. Oh, yes. My attack. Well, actually, it's not that much, but it did go up by five. Sweet. Okay. That's the door. Stairs. Now remember to get off the tracks as fast as possible. Oh, yes. Don't get hit by a train. Oh, so I'm just taking it out here. Possible. Seems very possible. There's a lot of them. This is the part of the sewer where there's no sewage. Yep. Just a straight slap to the back of the head. One Bam. open palm slap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was basically a quick travel point. Yeah, I'm alright. Don't worry about me. Here she is. Okay. Pacing. Doing what she can. Thinking about the troops. Welcome back! I'm glad you're okay. You defeated the bear? Great! Let's get to Sh Shin Saibasa! Bashi! It's probably she. That's that. Uh, oh, what, is she following us? Yeah. Nice! An ally! As long as she doesn't... Well, if she's an ally that causes us to fast travel, which I don't think she is, that would be great. Or if she just... If fights don't start when she's around. 
So Come far, on. so good. You wouldn't hit a Tokyo girl. <laughs> She's not a Tokyo girl. She's from here. She's, oh, right. She's oh, an Osaka geez. girl. Yeah. And indeed, yep. Yeah. I'm I really am curious if she's going to help us. So far, she's just sort of circling. And coming perilously close to my punches. No, stop. Mio, damn it. <laughs> Get off of me. She's got her own full-on health bar, too. Okay, there we go. Right. But she won't fight. Hey, do you need these cash cuts? Mia, talk yeah. to me, please. Like, can we interact? No, because there's no books to learn moves from in this game. Well, my guy I'll just try to interact with everything as I walk past it. It can't be a thing. Nope. Nope. Why? Hold on. What if I use a prepaid cash card while standing in front of this thing? Now that happens. Okay. I don't know. I don't know either. It doesn't seem to be affecting our ability to progress. Ah! That was my bad. I got us all hyped up to go to the right. You did. Here it comes. I can hear the train coming. It's coming around the bend. You want to get on the train super quick, Mio? Yeah. Mio, it's it's. Osaka it's, is what like the the average American suburbanite thinks every city is like. Yes. She walked too close to the train tracks. Except there's very little drug use going on, as far as we can tell. I mean, there's people who carry bottles in the subway. It's true. Oh. Oh, Miho got involved! I, she threw a slap just now. Good. And, and you, you, uh... I rewarded her, James, yeah. for her loyalty. Well, as long as she can't aggro against us and create an unwinnable state. Yes. Okay. And then out. And then we want to leave. Man, and then just go to the like bridge. I appreciate what they were going for in these well-developed urban environments where you do have to go from the subway through the underground up to the streets but it sure does create a lot of screens to walk through that's right taiko still getting lots of experience points that's good not quite caught up you're still one level ahead of me yeah and I suspect will be for most of the game yeah but we we're no longer dealing with a situation where riki is like significantly disadvantaged compared mm -hmm. to kunio I was gonna say it doesn't seem like there's anybody. For a moment, I was like, "Are people just actually gone home? This is nighttime." What do you consider that the average Osaka is a weirdo looking for a fight with a stranger? Oh Miho, no! You're killing me here. Come on, come on, girl. There <laughs> we, we go. go. All right. In Ultima Underworld, none of the hallways are wide enough to accommodate two people, so you have to spend so much time shoving. NPCs down to the end of the hallway into a corner so you can turn and get out of the way. Okay. Oh, where are the others? I think they're planning to come in the afternoon. Oh, God fuck. damn it, Mio. They, well, Mio! They can't just, like... I don't control the time of day, Mio! Oops. Don't go yet, but we'll flip it. Flip we'll flip it, yeah. So aren't you delinquents? What, do you have a curfew? Yeah, you seriously, go. We are literally planning a secret quest to undermine a gang by forming a to... counter gang. This is not an afternoon kind of meeting. Like, the cover of darkness is not a bad thing to have right now. There's a bit in Persona 5 where they changed the... Uh... 
They change the headquarters in that game between missions usually. Oh yeah. Uh, and there was one point in which their headquarters is just a... Who'd you have to fight at the end of Act 2? Hmm. Anyway, the headquarters is just... Just like an overpass inside of like a station. Just like an above ground, like... Like, like this, like a pedestrian walkway, but like enclosed above ground, like in glass. Mm. Uh, and they talk about how uh, the reason it's a great place to meet is that no one will, will like listen to what they say there. Yeah. Everyone will just sort of ignore them. All right, we're in the scene. Where are we? Oh, oh where are the others? others? She's going to say, I think they'll be here in the afternoon. No. No, fantastic. A lot of crazy stuff's been happening. Hey, Robbie, you're okay. That guy saved me. He came here from Tokyo. His name's Kunio, and... What? Oh, well, where's he staying? Hotel, Hotel Osaka. Why you ask? I'm sorry. Is that so? Hotel Osaka, eh? This guy's got a real shifty way of speaking. Yeah. At all times. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Our strategy's been leaked. The Union led an ambush at Nanba. Oh? What happened to Yoshihiro and... Sorry. They're probably being held captive. What should we do? If we go to Namba, we might be able to get more information. But now our enemies are all over Namba Station. <laughs> oh wow! New animation from Kunio. Yeah. How about we go to the underground? That was you. Along the sewer path, no, this is a rabbit. There was a door, but it was locked. I couldn't get in. If you need the key, I have it. Was it a rabbit? Oh, I thought it was a God rabbit. damn it. What the hell, man? <laughs> <laughs> but hey, with this, we'll be able to save both of them. But I don't think the Union would let that happen so easily, do you? Just means we have to be prepared. All right, then let's give it a go. Yeah, let's do it. Cops! The scram! I heard some suspicious characters gather around here. Caught you red-handed. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Look like you got guts! Don't worry, we won't talk. Trust us. Leave this to us! P but <laughs> You still have a lot to do. The streets will be crawling with cops soon. We'll be fine, so get going. I feel like his voice is getting deeper to, to compensate for mine. Yeah. <laughs> he, he feels, you know, that, that's, that, that's just happening. This is a thing. Go already. It'll be fine. <laughs> It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Something funny? Bro, oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! He killed her! Or at least beat them both unconscious. We are, I mean, we already know this cop is a knockout punch. Mmm. Your body's checking the station out on the streets. Searching the situation out on the streets. Okay. Okay. So where are we going? I know we gotta go to Namba, but... We gotta find another sewer passageway. Okay. It... If we had tried all the doors, we probably would have discovered that one of them was Should we locked. be on the streets, or should we be... No, I think your obvious. Oh, here we go. Hey, hey, looks like you have got... Okay, no, so we can't go down there. Oh, well that focuses the mind. Can we can go down this here? one? Oh, we can go probably to hey, hey, where like we were guns. being caught before. Which was a similar basement to the kind of basements we've already used to access. Yes, here we go. Oh, and in fact, your obvious. Really. Oh, wait a second. Hold on. There you co there are cops everywhere. The only way to get to Nambu is to go through the sewers here. Okay, hold on one second, though. 
Yeah. Ah, can you use the medical tent to heal? Uh, I can't get into the medical tent. Yeah. No. Damn it. It's just a... No. Only the, like, electrical things that hurt you. Hey, we have a party now. Rubby is with us. It's going to be so much friendly fire. Oh, especially me knocking you right out with two punches. Holy shit, you destroyed me. How did you do that? I have the boxing gloves. <laughs> All right. They well. do nothing. They just circle around. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Robbie, God damn it! At least he has infinite health. Yeah. He should go down. He should have minus, like, 10 health. Yeah. He should go down in one hit, easily. <laughs> she did a couple of slaps. Oh, man. There had to be a better way to have AI allies. Okay. Okay. Let's advance the plot as much as we can. Yeah. There was a rock there. Could have killed someone with a rock. Whoa, long that's also screen. we gotta call it quits after this, whatever this is. Okay. So let's create a safe state. Shh. It's I, Kumia. Someone there. Way to go, water. Using the police like that was a great idea. Damn. They'll shut the alliance up for sure. What? Who are you? Why did you say anything, you Albert? Okay. Okay. Well. Oh, and he runs away! Hey, you! Sakamoto Punk, get ready for a beatdown! Unlikely. You guys are just mooks. Yeah, this is not your day. It's not your day, friends. Also, I was off base doing a girl voice for any of these characters. Nope, none of them are girls. One of them just has a girly voice! Yeah. It happens. Yeah, I thought this Mamoru was a young lady. Oh wow, she did quite a deal of damage to him with her uh, with her slaps. Good work, Mio. Got some experience. Who are you? Damn, the cops heard the commotion. Come on, hurry! It's damn cops. Okay. Safe state, James. All right. Let's so here we there. are in yet another parking garage. But all right, we've we've rediscovered our uh, our commitment to the quest. Yeah, I'm After willing to play this again. Way. Now that we've gotten to a point where we're advancing the plot a lot, I really feel like the first bit of the game does not put a good foot forward in how long it takes you to get yeah places. There's some there's some balance and progression like, balancing to get to get to the second area she she is shabashi we had to go on a long subway fight that's what we did last episode we had yeah. to go we had to fight instead of taking the train the train never comes you just have to walk along the subway tracks before we can then do that area we have to go all the way back to the hotel that's mandatory so all those times we died and got teleported back to the hotel like we needed to do we needed to do that at least once yep yeah. And then you have to go all the way back, all the way over, all the way. And, it, and then it's watched. just like, all right, bam, 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 yeah, bam, and then bam, 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 bam. Cutscene every few steps. Uh, we've taken a one of four. They've provided us a good metric for what we would expect. Yeah. That'll probably accelerate, though. There might even be the two of the four are like, you know, twins. You fight them at the same time, yeah. But, yeah, we are moving in a good direction, it feels. And... We discovered at least one sweet new song, and generally good songs. It's not there's nothing remarkable about this plot, but I'm invested. I want to put an end to the Osaka Student Union, yeah. or restore the rightful leader and have the Osaka Student Union bring peace and balance to Osaka, which is Lord knows Osaka could use a little Osaka peace and balance. really needs it. So bust this team. Friday night, Friday night frost even will be occurring. Uh, we are in a scenario called the Dead Mile, which is an escape scenario. Very small that, map. That, yeah, the whole map. Like, we've already cleared one room, and the second room is the same size as the first room. 
Uh, so what's the gimmick? What's going to happen when this door opens? Is it just that it's a really, really packed, hard room? Are the ma- or do we have to tag up and then escape back to the start? Is it going to tell us to take... Once everyone has left the first map tile, lift it up and move it over to make this thing longer? I don't know. I don't know. But, so, like, the game is up front with you about which tiles you're going to need and what they're ultimately going to look like, even though you only get the room layout of the first tile, obviously, on the, no. or the first room. But it tells um, you what the whole map is, right? And it's just yeah. two tiles. Yeah. So, if it was just one tile, they it would be a fair, dead like, kilometer. There isn't, so, there, that was a great joke, James. You gotta, you gotta that was good. give us some space. Yeah, that's right. I didn't, I didn't internalize it enough to react properly, but that was a good joke. Uh, the, um, yeah, there hasn't been a time yet where it's been like surprise. You have to There's go more tiles, and get yeah. more tiles. And I, so, what's it gonna be? We'll find it together. Saturday, uh, I'll be back with the perils of Rosella. I'm a little bit kind of stuck right now but the two thoughts i have are oh no i just had a terrible third thought but one thought <laughs> is i found you know i've met the shark in the in the water the shark just kills you i met the whale the whale just swallows you but it seems when you're in it to not be suffocated by its its uh, breath you need to quickly climb its tongue up and then i think tickle its uvula but I don't have... So I need, like, a feather or a feather duster. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I don't have one. So... But I don't know. Uh, but... One thought had occurred to me, which is, what if there is other stuff in the water? Now that... This is the first time that going into the water... Because in, in King's Quest 2, there were all these water screens I kept swimming around, and it's just nothing. There's nothing to it. The, the whole thing that happens at the water is automatically directed when you meet a mermaid on the shore. Uh, but this time, things are happening in the water. So what if there's other things? I should look around. And then also, I have the flute, and it feels like... Like, you say play flute, and then you get a scene of Rosella playing the flute. It kind of feels like... On some screen, that flute does something. And I haven't played it on every single available screen. What if it opens the crypt? What if it dries up the waterfall, so I can go in the cave behind the waterfall? What if it annoys the ogre's dog so much that they smash out the window, and then if I escape from them, I can climb through the window and get in the ogre's house? I don't think it's going to be that. But, yeah, those are my two thoughts to try, and then the horrible thought that I just had. Is that all the King's Quest games so far feature NPCs and enemies that are... They, they have their set locations, but they're there sometimes, and they're not there sometimes. And right. Like, to get the porridge from the three bears in the third game, once I realized I needed it, I had to go into their house and leave, and go back in, and leave, and go back in, and then the porridge was there. And it's like, okay. And it just, I, it just occurred to me, what if sometimes, like, Jonah is in the whale? I just haven't met Jonah the times I've been swallowed by the whale. What if just... that? Wait, that so doesn't... is Jonah, like... Do you know for a fact Jonah's in the game? No. Well, then it's a storybook, right? Yeah. So wouldn't it be Pinocchio's dad in the whale, not Jonah? Geppetto. Jonah is biblical. Yeah. Geppetto just gets swallowed by a whale, you know. Well, now I feel silly about all that stuff I said. But, oh, hey, now we're incorporating Bible stories alongside. Because <laughs> uh, that's an excellent point, Greg. Uh, although, technically, Pinocchio, I don't know, is Pinocchio a fairy tale? It's a fable. Where does it originate? It's as much a. It's. I think it's as. I think it's contemporaneous with Little Mermaid, at least. I mean, obviously, there's some Pygmalion uh, influence, so there's classical precedent for the concept of creators. The coming character off. of a Pinocchio originates, of course, in an Italian story from 1883. Oh, cool. So, yeah. So okay, I like. I hope. I wouldn't put it past Roberta Williams to do that. You gotta get swallowed by the whale, but also there's a, only a 30% chance that the character who needs to be in there for you to escape the whale is there. But that does seem a little crueler than a, even a lot of Roberta Williams uh, design features, so hopefully it's not that. And then, you know, if forced to, I will do the old adventure game standby. For every notable thing on the map, type use inventory item one on thing. Yeah, on, on, on. Until you find the random thing. But you know what? 
so far in King's Quest, except for a couple of absurd puzzles that uh, I either got lucky on or had read about and didn't have to solve, mostly it's played pretty fair, I feel, especially if you're attuned to fairy tale logic. So I think I'll work something out. I hope. We'll see. Find it together. Uh, I'd love to be a short session, both because I have other commitments and because I learned on Sunday when I did a long session that my slightly weaker right eye, because I have just regular vision in my left eye and then mild, mild bad vision in my right eye. That's enough that if I play the primitive 3D of Ultima Underworld 2 for too long, my brain will hurt for the rest of the day. Oh no! Yeah. So I... Uh, it's going to be shorter, but we're going back into the Labyrinth of Worlds with Ultima Underworld 2. And before you know it, we'll be in this underworld. Yeah. The uh, the Nanda sewers. <laughs> the Nanba. Nanba. Nanba sewers. And we will... Uh, maybe maybe now we've broken through the dam and we'll just, just steamroll the rest of the game. I think if you do I die... It's before... either a three or four session playthrough. Yes. And I will say, if you do die uh, before having to return to the hotel, which seems to be something we do frequently, uh, then, you know, this, this might take us a little bit to get back to, but I think we're leveled enough that Shinshibashi is not going to be such an insurmountable no, hurdle no. as Shinsa, it was before. Shinshibashi is no longer where we go to be destroyed. Yes. So, hey, onwards and upwards. Take us home, Greg. All right, well, thank you for joining us. Thank you for sticking around to the end if you did. Please follow us down below or subscribe. James is now considering offering things. I've seen the talks in the Discord. Oh, but don't subscribe now on the promise of I'm going to think of some things like over the holiday break or possibly in the summer. <laughs> <laughs> but he is offering always 30 days of conditional gratitude. Keep re-upping. Ah, goodbye, I've got it by voices. Thanks for dropping Thanks by. Thanks for dropping by. And remember, everyone, not just got it by voices, but that violence is a, never the answer. Except in video games. Bye. Keep it real.